Okay, this is Mofosi Review, and today we're looking at the Power Rangers Redful Fire series, the Zeo Megazord. Now, for some reason, it's it still has Power Rangers Samurai on the side, side, you know, Power Rangers Zero, Zeo, right here. It's like a what the fuck. But, I didn't buy this guy recently. If any of you guys actually watch my haul videos, this is from Christmas. And it's my birthday today. It's the 28th of April, so... Yeah. <laughs> so, um, I'm pretty sure that this, the Mystic... The Titan Megas, whatever the fuck they called it in Mystic Force, I only haven't watched the American version. I haven't watched, actually, I haven't watched Power Rangers since. Dino Thunder? Yeah, I think too, so, because Ninja Storm was before that, so yeah, Dino Thunder. I haven't watched any since that. I've only been watching. The Super Sentai, and because they're a few years ahead. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure Magic King. This is a reissue, and then it just shows a fucking only on Nickelodeon. Cool battle poses. I really hope it's cool battle poses, because if you. See this, the MP, the MMPR Megazord. There's only like two or three good poses in them. Hope it has more. Oh, yeah, and that's the remolds of the my the Mighty Morphin Megazord released like two years ago. I think it was 010. Mm, like, right here. Mm. Fuck. Fuck her. There, there you go. Hello there. Can you read it now? Whatever, you can read it while I discuss it um so what this is just like a series summary it's like in 1996 when i was born power ranger zero series the power ranger faces the dreaded villains king mondo and queen machina a powerful pair who rule over their machine empire those were the villains back in the day this fearsome empire full of robots it's powerful enough to scare Lord Zed and Rita to flee with their forces, uh, abandoning the moon with these metallic armor. I'm not reading this for your sake, I'm just reading this for mine. That's why I sound very mumbly. And back in the in the wild force for Red, the they reused um the the mighty more no not mighty more the big bad um beetle board suits like um shadow board dragon board butterfly board or was that no lady board i think they called her back in there um fought lightning board and the the original um green beetle board and whatever um Joined by their bratty offspring, Prince Sprocket, who label uh, King Mondo and Queen Machina, commanded command fierceless and powerful army of cogs who lend this robot's dedicated message. Dominate the universe with discovery of the powerful Zeo crystals, which is in the Mighty Morphin, no, no, the Power Rangers version. They actually went back into time to get these zero crystals. The crime fighters utilized the news to save Zordon and Afro Five from 
certain decimation. Yes, not destruction, decimation. Ranger to the Mexico, Trey of the planet Trey 4. I'm on the second paragraph. Trey falls in battle up the original leader, the Power Rangers, Jason, on the Good Ranger Powers and Hunters. The Power and Pyramid is now with greater powers than ever before. And the uniforms and the new Zeonizer Zero Rangers, the virtual army. Not really, the Mega Rangers were the virtual army. And Legion is a matter of crime. I, I don't know why they say virtual army. They mean it in the other sense. And yeah, but in the other sense. No. They're in reality. Sort of. And it's a 4 plus, and here we go. They're back to the Saban brands! And, uh, I haven't really watched Power Rangers Samurai. I can already. I know it's kind of crap. The toys are kind of crappy because they remolded it. They don't import it in Japan, from Japan anymore. Which is kind of sad. Because I thought when Saban regained the brand, he would at least, like, re-import them from Japan like he did with all the other Zords back in the day. But alas, that was not the case. I don't even, honestly, I don't even remember when they've started with the, hey, let's not import these from Japan, make them cheaper to make, but also fucking suck here in terms of show accuracy and fucking transformation. Just give it to kids. After all, who cares about the collectors? <laughs> Actually, that, that's more Hasbro. Fucking Bakon. And, and hi to whoever's in Bakon right now. It's the weekend for Bakon. It's like second day. And if you're at Bakon 2012 right now, I could ask you, why the hell are you in your living room watching a 16-year-old do a review on something you probably don't care about. Well, some of you anyway. I don't know how many you like Power Rangers as well as Transformers. And there we go. Motherfucker! So I seriously had to open both sides for this shit. That's just sh crap. Now, as you see here, there's a samurai symbol. No, this was Zio. It's just some random shit. So here, I'm gonna take the sword out. It's a bit weird that they didn't bother to color this silver. But well, no, that's that's alright. As you can see, there's no. You just pull it out like in the old days. No rubber bands or twisty ties to screw around with. Just plain old. Get me out of here. Type deal. In terms of this, how do I get the wings out without fucking something over? Okay, this was a crap idea. Who, who fucking packaged your toys like this for freaking five years to claw the way out of?
And by the way, the packaging since the original Retro Fire line started has changed quite a bit. Back with the Zeo, not Zeo, the Money Morphing one, um, everything it was in a freaking, um, what's it? A card package. And they included stickers. Well, believe me, they include stickers, and then later, in the later waves, they did the hemi circle shit, which probably would explain why these are still like half done like this instead of just a full circle. I don't know. But anyway, back to this. Well, as you see, again, with these retro fire. Zords, they take a lot of uh, what do you call it? Lenience, not lenience. Creative interpretation. That's what. That's what I'm gonna put. In. Artistic interpretation for these Zords, like the. Well, actually, the portions of this isn't really that bad compared to the other um, Zords, besides for this, the Taurus Zord being a little bit crooked, and so is the head, the head is crooked, uh, there we go, the wings are another, are, um, why, why can't I think of the word, I just said it like twice in a row, like just before, Interpretation of the wings, they were never used in this formation. The wings spread outward a lot. There's always just clothes back here. The shoulders are a bit larger now. They're still in These has a skinnier waist right here. Legs are more longer than you were in the original toy. Let's just go through the portion. This is a ball joint neck, arm presumably 360, moves outward. Let's get this shit centered. Out almost 180, there's no elbow joint, there's a wrist swivel. There's a there's a waist swivel, but it's really tight, especially with the wings in the way. Of course, wings can pop out. Oh, the hips can go all the way, 360 swivel joint. An almost 90 degree turn here. The ankle go about that far in and that far out. Actually, this is very stiffer than this. It's weird. So, yeah. It's interesting that you, it says that you can do battle poses with this, but you can't really do any aerial battle poses since this wave does not come with the action base, and now you can see how much fucking dust this has. Yuck. See, you can't not do this action. I have to say, this is kind of a weak ass pose anyway. Whatever. And you can see the artistic differences, like the horns, and the horns being exaggerated, the shoulder pads, and the Mammoth head being different, the tiger, see what you tiger and the triceratops being more streamlined. 
and Discovering It channel is still getting the goddamn Oh, CO Team 6, oh, hey. It's so secret. Let's tell you all their secrets, oh, yes. It's been all going on for like a few hours now. You can hear it during my review of this guy, which, is, which just came before the, this video. And so it's been <laughs> 15 minutes, oh, well. So I'm gonna Actually this does not have a swivel, only this one does. So. And this is the action pose I'm gonna put it in. So I'm going to end this and right after I put this up here. Yeah. Oh, fuck, don't, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, motherfucker. And there they are, even though the zeal zord looks ridiculous right now I'm gonna keep it like that so this is mofo see that stay tuned for another video review yes. whoops I took a picture uh -huh, wrong button damn it